Welcome to Math with Mr. J. In this video, I'm going to cover multiplying exponents with the same base. Now when we do this, we keep the base the same and then add the exponents. For example, x to the power of a times x to the power of b is going to equal x to the power of a plus b. Let's jump into our examples and see exactly how this works. Starting with number one, where we have x squared times x cubed. Well, the first thing we do, we keep the base. So our base is x. So let's write out our x. And then we add the exponent. So we have an exponent of two and an exponent of three. Two plus three equals five. So our final answer, x to the power of five. Let's see exactly how this works, starting with x squared. So x squared means x times x. So let me write that out, x times x. I'm going to bring down the multiplication sign that's in between, and then x cubed means x times x times x. So x times x times x. This right here, this is x squared. And this right here, this is x cubed. And you can see that we have five x's there, which is x to the power of five. Let's move on to number two, where we have five to the power of seven times five cubed. Well, keep the base the same. Our base is five. And then we add the exponents. So seven plus three is 10. So five to the 10th power, which equals 9,762,000 625. Now let's take a look and see how this works after we break it down, just like we did for number one. So five to the power of seven, well that means five times five times five times five times five times five times five and then we bring our multiplication sign down in the middle here, and then five cubed is five times five times five. So we have five to the power of seven represented right here. Then we have five cubed represented right here. And that gives us five to the power of 10. So remember, keep the base the same and then add the exponents when multiplying exponents with the same base. I hope that helped. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, peace.